I'm here to announce the completion of our withdrawal from Afghanistan and the end of the military mission to evacuate American citizens, third country nationals, and vulnerable Afghans. It's a milestone nearly two decades in the making. The Pentagon confirmed this afternoon that the last U.S. troops in Afghanistan have been withdrawn. The head of the U.S. Central Command said the final planes left just before 3.30 p.m. Eastern Time Monday. According to a Taliban guard, celebratory gunfire ensued. The final departures come just before President Biden's deadline at the end of the month to get all troops out. It also concludes a major evacuation mission that got more than 116,000 people out of Afghanistan in two weeks. Tonight's withdrawal signifies both the end of the military component of the evacuation, but also the end of the nearly 20-year mission that began in Afghanistan shortly after September 11th, 2001. It's a mission that brought Osama bin Laden to a just end, along with many of his al-Qaeda co-conspirators. It comes on the same day ISIS-K launched rockets into a Kabul neighborhood, and just a few days after a suicide bombing killed 13 U.S. service members and nearly 170 Afghans.